everyone, I'm Danny here with Jobert at Pond5. Today we'll be showing you everything you need to know to jumpstart your project with our versatile AE templates. Before purchasing an AE template, there are a few things you should check to make sure that everything runs smoothly on your end. First, check if the version of After Effects you're using is compatible with the template you've chosen. A good rule of thumb is to use the most current version of the software because it will open templates created from older versions as well. Next, determine if it needs a third-party plugin. If it does, make sure you have that one installed. A lot of our artists like to use plugins from companies like Red Giant and Video Copilot. Finally, read the description. This can give you a lot of information, including the resolution of the template, how many placeholders there are, and if the images and audio used in the preview are included. For ease of use, all Pond5 AE templates are downloadable as a zip file. But because every artist has a different way of organizing their files, each template may be arranged differently. As a standard, however, all the templates you download will have a help file, a folder for all the assets or materials used in the template, and the After Effects project file itself. Before modifying your template, it's always a good idea to save a copy so that you can go back to the original version of the file at any time. To do this, simply go to File, then Save As, and give your copy a different name from the original. The After Effects work area is composed of panels arranged inside the application window. This arrangement is called a workspace. One of the great things about AE is that you can resize and rearrange these panels to create your own custom workspace. The project panel contains all your media and any composition you make inside After Effects. If you need to find a file or a composition, this is where it will be. The composition panel is where you see your creation. Think of it as your canvas. You can drag objects directly into it as well as move them around. The timeline panel is where you do a lot of your work. Some of the things you can do here include adjusting properties, changing the timing and duration of layers, and adjusting effects. Whatever you do in the timeline panel will immediately show in the composition panel. When the playhead and the timeline panel move, the composition panel updates as well. The effects controls panel is where you can change the settings of effects that you apply on a layer in your timeline. You can also do this in the timeline, but it's a lot more straightforward to do it in the effects panel. The effects and presets panel, as the name implies, is where you can search for effects and presets you may want to use in your composition. And of course, let's not forget our Tools panel, where all our tools are located, like the Move tool, Mask tool, and Text tool. Another important panel is the Render Queue. This provides one of the ways to export your compositions as videos from AE. All Pond5 templates are thoroughly tested before being added to our collection, but every computer system is different, and each template may behave differently when opened. Here are some messages you might see when you first open your template. This simply means that the template was created from an older version of AE. This will not affect the template in any way. Note that the version number of the software and the operating system will vary. This appears when the fonts used in the template are not installed on your computer. The newer version of After Effects will show you the Resolve Fonts window, and older ones will show you a different warning, but both will tell you what fonts are missing so that you can download or purchase them. This means that After Effects can't find a file or files used in the template. This can be easily fixed by relinking the files manually. Go to File, Dependencies, Find Missing Footage. The project panel would show you all the unlinked or missing files in your template. Select the missing file in the project panel, then right-click and choose Replace Footage, and then browse to where the actual file is on your computer. If you need additional help with any After Effects templates from Pond5, just let us know by emailing support at pond5.com, and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Have fun!